Uh, we start tonight with drama in East Cleveland, where the East Cleveland City Council filed an emergency resolution. Okay, City Council says the mayor decided to use a budget created by himself and not the City Council, which would put the city in $30 million in debt over the next five years. No Fisher's trying to keep all of this straight in the ledgers and whatnot. This is a very confusing story, but basically you have the mayor and you have city council and nobody is getting along. There's a lot going on right now and the mayor's budget is actually $10 million more than the city council's budget each year. And that's the city council budget that was approved by them. The city council says the mayor and the finance director in East Cleveland have been reckless and have failed to perform their duties for the residents in East Cleveland. The city council now filing that emergency resolution to charge Mayor Brandon King and the finance director with dereliction of duty. That council hereby requests the East Cleveland Municipal Court to issue a probable cause ruling that the two officers exceeded the authority of their public offices by recklessly creating deficiencies and expending more than the council appropriated for the year 2023. Three News reached out to Mayor Brandon King for comment and did not hear back. But during the press conference, we were given a statement by East Cleveland's law director that says in part, currently we are in litigation with city council involving not only the legitimacy of appointed councilors, but also there's a discrepancy involving whom they hired as council clerk until both are resolved. We should expect these kind of accusations End quote right now. There is not any trust between East Cleveland's city council and the mayor. City council says the mayor has misled residents. There's a lot going on and continuing to unfold. It doesn't look like it'll have a quick resolution either. No, All right. I'm sure you'll continue to follow it. Neil, thanks.